Lucamus Prime here doing another voice comparison reaction for another Marvel villain being my favourite Spider-Man villain, Doctor Octopus. So, full volume and full screen and let's go! So, Spider-Man, you're not the only one who knows how to use a web. This is my great day. Not only does Spider-Man fall into my clutches, but my I'll go and give him some invention up. is ready. It will give me power to rule the universe. <laughs> Not even my sworn enemy Spider-Man could survive that devastation. Now that the nullifier is in my possession, I am master of mm. all space. Now I'll give him a thumbs up too. Without my permission, a privilege I shall grant. What a price! <laughs> I've done it. Only the mechanical arms of Dr. Octopus could have stolen this billion dollar ruby. You! So I have to do to get I'll give him a thumbs up too. This guy's watched loads of uh, villains in the classic Super Hero TV show, doesn't he? Lex Luthor and also Doc Ock. And yeah, may he rest in peace, yes. Yeah. yeah, the first voice actor's also dead, may he rest in peace. Hmm, there's something off about Michael Bell's voice here. Um, I'll say not bad. I like him better was Prowl from um, Transformers Generation 1 and Sideswipe from that same show. Uh, I'll give him a not bad. Oh yes, heck yes. That show, I, I, I saw a few episodes of this when I was a kid. And I love one featuring Doc Ock. Oh yeah, mate, Ephraim Zimbalist Jr. Rest in peace. He also played Alfred in Batman Animated Series too. I think he plays the best voice in like animation. It's a pity that he's dead. Yeah, that that accent, you know, that Germanic accent, that is really good for Doc Ock as well. Yes! Absolute yes! Alpha Molina, he was amazing as Doc Ock in Spider-Man 2. The way he portrayed him is phenomenal. He's my favourite Doc Ock of all time. No one comes close to him. And I love how he came back for a video game based on a movie. Not everyone really did, but besides him and Tobey Maguire did, but... He didn't die a monster either, thankfully. Come and take a look at my masterpiece. Yes, yes, oh yeah, I played this game when I was a kid, Bandor Fall. And this is um, uh, Daffy Duck, but he's dead now, Joel. Ask him, may rest in peace. Um, I like it, I'll give him a thumbs up. I'll give him a not bad. I do like Peter McNichol, but I think he's better as a Mad Hatter from Batman. There's something off about his voice. Doesn't really sound very antagonistic, does it? Sounds a bit odd. Tests 
Oh, this is Lady Octopus from the future. I'll give Katara a stronger thumbs up for Lady Octopus. This isn't even Dr. Octopus, this is a different character. Weird how she's been added to this. I think I've played this game too. I think you encounter him in 2099 as well, if I remember correctly. Oh. Really? Uh, no, I don't like it. I like him as Starscream from the Michael Bay Transformers films, but not as Doc Ock. And this show is rubbish too. It's more for kids, really. Oh yeah, I played this game. Hmm. He's not really in character. I'll give him a not bad for. Tom Kenny. Okay, I'll give Tom Kenny a thumbs up. He sounds a bit creepy, which is good, I guess, for a villain. He's got a good villainous laugh, too. <laughs> oh, yeah, I played this game when I was a kid. Loved it. Although, the voice is a little bit off, too. Uh, I'll give Dean Oliver a thumbs up. I love him as for Clone Troopers. And also a Klaus from American Dad. But I don't think he's... He's not that good as Doc Ock, though. Oh, yeah, this is a ride at Universal and an adventure in Florida. I've been on this ride. I'll definitely give him a thumbs up. Wow. When it all comes down to there's only two that I like, and it's Alpha Millionaire from Spider-Man 2 and F from Zimbalist Jr. from a 994 cartoon. Only them two are my favourites. Wow. And that's his theme tune. Okay, so this is me actually a voice comparison for Doc Ock. So um, give this video a like, and um, tell me in the comments who you like for me as the voice of Doc Ock. Now also, there's a chance that Doc Ock may appear in the MCU, so tell me, who do you think could play Doc Ock? But it will be a hard de decision because of Alfred Molina's amazing performance. I mean, we need to find someone who can top it. I mean, maybe we won't top it, but who knows? So let me know who you think could play Doc Ock. And subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you all soon with a voice comparison for Venom.